As many of you may know, China is pretty infamous for fake stuff, fake clothing, fake electronics, and even fake foods. Some people have been very creative in creating foods that look really good but are actually quite dangerous. So here are 10 fake foods to watch out for when you're in China. Number one, fake eggs. If you're in China and you're trying to find eggs for the cheap, double check to make sure that they're actually real eggs. The tip here is if the eggs sell for about six cents cheaper than they usually go for, they might be fake. Now, if you're suspicious that the eggs may be fake, here's how you can tell. The fake eggs are too perfectly shaped and smooth. Also, real eggs have a faint smell to them that imitation eggs lack. And if you tap a fake egg, it sounds much more hollow than a real egg would. Number two, walnuts filled with cement. This sounds pretty ridiculous, but fake walnuts are actually a thing. People are actually replacing the walnuts meat with concrete chips and paper so that the nuts doesn't make a suspicious noise when it's shaken and then glued shut together. Number three, Three, beef, but not really. If you go into a restaurant and order a big bowl of beef noodle soup, be careful because the beef may not actually be beef, but instead pork disguised as beef. This is possible by using a beef extract that can turn pork into fake beef in about 90 minutes. Number four, black and white pepper. You can't even get real seasoning in China anymore, and this is shown by the fact that people are making man-made black and white pepper. A vendor was caught making pepper from questionable ingredients and was discovered by a shopper in Guangdong province. And upon further investigations, authorities found that the black pepper was actually made from local mud, and the white pepper was mainly composed of flour. Next up, number five, honey. Honey is one thing you should almost never buy in China. Did you know that up to 60 to 70% of all the honey in China are actually fake? This was proven by an investigation made by Jinan Times revealing the malpractice in the Shandong honey industry. Since sugar syrup is really cheap, many companies have been adding it to honey to make some profits. Number six, plastic rice. Singapore media reported that this so-called rice is made from potatoes, sweet potatoes, and poor poisonous plastic. Number seven, rat mutton. Authorities have found that people in China have used chemicals to transform rat meat into mutton slices, which are a popular type of meat used in Chinese hot pots. But here's how you can tell these two meats apart. When they bring out the meat for hot pot, it's typically frozen. Wait till it thaws and try to separate the fat from the lean parts of the meat. The fake mutton fat and meat would easily separate, while the real mutton would stay intact. Number eight, chemical tofu. In China, a dried tofu tofu stick was found to have been sold that contained cancer-causing chemicals. This chemical is called rongolite, an industrial bleaching agent that made these dried tofu slices chewier and brighter. Number nine, fake wine. China is the largest importer of French wine, but French wine is expensive. So some distributors had the idea of taking cheap wine and putting them in the expensive wine bottles. And the trickery is not limited to just wine. A lot of alcohol in China is fake as well. And finally, number 10, cardboard buns. Supposedly, a supplier in Beijing found a way to keep the price down by using cardboard as a substitute filling. There's actually a recipe online for cardboard xiaolong bao or soup dumplings. I don't know what these things taste like. I don't know if they actually taste like a pork steamed bun. I hope never to find out and I hope you guys will never find out either. So guys, I hope you found this video useful. Thank you all so much for watching. See you later.